New this morning, if you're walking in downtown St. Pete this weekend, you might hear a sweet, strange sound. Loud, live music coming from one of its most popular outdoor venues. And here's ABC Action News reporter Sean Daly with father and son musicians helping bring rock and roll back to Janice Live. Billy Wells and River Wells, father and son, and the big beating heart of St. Pete's Sons, who are playing a free rock show at the long dormant Janice Live this Saturday. When you hear it, follow it, and come see what's going on inside. Local venues are still figuring out how to safely bring crowds back. It will be loud, but it will be different. Well, we're doing the safest possible. They are arranging the courtyard to accommodate social distancing, like you'll have high top stations instead of like a, yeah, let's go check it out the stage. It's not set up that way. St. Pete's Sons are a hot Bay Area band, but they still have the calendar from a year ago when they unplugged for a long time. The world shut down. This place got abandoned for a good long while. For River Wells, a student at the University of Florida, this is a symbolic show, not just for the return to normalcy, but for the chance to rock out with his old band once again. Be up on stage and play with him, and, you know, he's a fantastic songwriter, too. So uh, it's, it's awesome, really. <laughs> See everybody Saturday. Doors at 8 p.m., music at 8.30. You've been put on sonic alert. In St. Petersburg, I'm Sean Daly, ABC Action News.